guys welcome happy wednesday happy hump day this is jackie aka fabulous day mm. hope i ain't got lipstick on my teeth anyway guys i am going to america way i bought some rolling racks they haven't delivered them they haven't called me <laughs> What if I go over there? Because I already paid for it. I have my receipt. I paid for delivery. What if I go over there and then they're closed? <laughs> Who am I going to call? Oh, no. Somebody's going to have to give me the owner's number. But anyway, I was supposed to hear from them on Saturday, but I didn't. So I'm going to go by there. Hopefully, they probably have some new stuff, I hope. I'm hoping, even though they're closing, store is empty. But they said that they were gonna keep getting stuff here and there, so let me go check. So that's where I'm headed. American way. Here I go. On my way back, I might stop at Goodwill. some more Thomas James glasses if they've had some new ones anyway guys I'll see you later so guys if I tell you there's no one here maybe one two three four cars <laughs> those of us that are pressed are the only ones going to America way so wow Thank you. 
Okay, guys, so I just left American way. Mm, mm, mm. Needless to say, they didn't have anything new. Same stuff. My rolling rack will be delivered tomorrow. I was like, if I didn't come over here, they would have not even delivered it. I just caught the guy. I'm like, oh, why you didn't deliver my stuff? He's like, oh, you were gonna call me. I said, no, you were gonna call me. But either way, they're gonna deliver it tomorrow in the morning. I need them rolling racks. Shoes, those things are steady. Said they've had it for 40 years. So now I think I will have to spray paint it. I don't know where I want to put it in my garage in the boutique or do I want to take it upstairs because I can use some more rolling racks upstairs it's like oof. so but anywho that was that I'm going to stop at Marshall no I don't know if I want to go to Goodwill tomorrow. I will go to Goodwill because tomorrow is Thursday. It's dollar ninety nine day. There's no need for me to go today and then go again tomorrow. So I will go tomorrow. Today I'm gonna maybe I'll stop at Uptown Chipsky. Who knows? There's a leather jacket there, a navy blue leather jacket that I wanted. But I don't know if I've acquired enough points. <sighs> and I didn't bring my shopping bag to get 10% off. There's a shopping bag at Uptown Chipskate if you because now they're going bagless. If you buy that bag, every time you shop, you get 10% off. But I always seem to forget that bag at home. I should put it in my trunk. Huh, that's sad. Alright. Maybe I won't go over there.
now guys I went to Salvation Army because I haven't been there for ages oh my eyes are super red and that's because I didn't sleep last night I was up all night long watching movies and shows some YouTube so you girl haven't slept and then I, on top of that when I had brunch I had mimosa so I'm feeling some kind of way so but I went to Salvation Army they don't lost their mind remember how jackets used to be nine dollars not anymore they're now 16 or 12. I, I'm like where am I I bought a leather jacket for $16.99 I bought a three-piece Fashion Nova suit pleather suit or full leather however you want to call it $24.99 but I did have a coupon so it came up to $18 but once upon a time those things were $9.99 oh if I'm not mistaken because this is crazy and um what is that about? I got about three three items oh and a brand new tweed blazer I think that one was $12.99 those things used to be I mean I was like what am I here sorry the sun is reflecting my salvation I mean you will not be seeing me no time soon but they are having a, a 2L uh, a sale on the 27 where all clothing is $2.99. I ain't see anything that's going to make me want to go. Oh, there's something that I might want to go get. There's a leather and tailor buttery yellow blazer. I don't know if it will fit me. It's a small, but it looks like it will give. So if that's still there, that I will pick up for $2.99. I will make that that trip I think it's, it's on, on 27 and 28 or 26 if it's 26 that will be better because uptown chips can have their own filler bag sale on the 27 25 dollars so you get a big kind of like a trash bag to fill up all your items oh my god but I gotta tell you the thrift stores have lost their mind with their prices Salvation Army of all people I'm like what American way. I am going to miss American way. And anyway, guys, I will talk to you later. I'm gonna probably go home and do my haul. Probably at um, Fabulous Jet to Life Sale is because this is a thrifting day for me. So most of my thrifting videos go on that channel. So that's what I'm gonna do. Uh, I don't know if I'll be doing any try on, but we will just see what I got. Alright, guys, see you later. Peace. Okay, guys, we are back in the boutique. Welcome, welcome to Fabulous Jet Life, Fabulous Jet Two Life Sale. This is my boutique, my garage boutique. So it's boutique Jackie. Let me show you guys. It was a hard day to thrift. It really was. I don't even know why I went out there, but I know why I went out there to go get my rolling racks. Because if I didn't go there, he wasn't gonna sh he wasn't gonna deliver them no time soon. I mean, I walked in. I was gonna get more racks, but they all sold. So I saw him. I said, "Uh, where is my rolling rack?" And he was like, "Uh," I'm like, "Ah, uh, don't do uh like what you mean." <laughs> He said, oh, they're in the back. I said, well, why you didn't deliver them? You told me you were going to deliver them the next day. But he didn't deliver them. So he says tomorrow. So that's tomorrow. If I don't get those things tomorrow morning, I'm going to march over there and raise hell. I don't want my money back. I want those damn rolling racks. I just hope they didn't double sell them because those things are really, really secure. But anyway what did i get while i was there three items they didn't get nothing new that i like they probably no they got some stuff they got some tahari outer jackets but they have the nerve to sell them for 40 dollars oh but i just not thought about it yellow tag was 50 percent off so it would have been 20 dollars oh well they had a few they're gonna be there till next week maybe saturday so i picked up my sim one of those Italian pieces because I did regret not getting the blue um, 
tweed one. So I find I, it was still there for four ninety nine fifty off. I got that. Do I want to put it in a hanger so you guys can see it nicely? You guys saw I got the other colors. So I got this one because I probably want to wear it with jeans. It has this elasticized waist. It has a full sleeve. And then we have their signature satin cutaways that I don't know what these are, but very cute. So I figured I'm going to wear this with jeans, you know, with some faded cargo pants. It's still made in Italy, guys. Why would I leave an Italian pieces behind? But some few pieces are still there. Few pieces are still there. If you didn't watch this video and you're just now watching this one, that is, uh, these are vintage Italian pieces made in Italy, vintage. I did buy a collection of them and I'm going to style them separately. They have major shoulder pads. Oh, I took off my, my braids, guys. I got to treat my hair for about a week before I put some more braids. So now there's no braid. My hair grew, okay? That African shabby oil worked wonders. It grew, so I'm just like treating my scalp. My hair is getting longer. So, but anyway, voila. This was half of $4.99, so this was $2.50. I got that. I can't wait to put this on. Yeah, maybe when I do my next video, I will wear this with some um cargo pants that i uh, i got from dd's beautiful cargo denim jeans or whatever and then i got this sweater sweater season guys it's getting cold everywhere you go every state is freezing 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 this was in the wrong spot somebody took it and put it in between all the scarves so this was half of $8.99 and this is beautiful cable knit chunky sweater I love the sleeves and this is by the brand this is extra large it's it's just Los Angeles STLR Astra not be familiar with this brand and um yeah the label i love it i love it so this was half of 8.99 so that was four dollars and fifty cents cute another one we can wear with some sweatpants i bought so many sweatpants from dds because they were having a blowout sale even what I'm wearing, not the jacket, but the two-piece I'm wearing is from Didi's. I will show you guys they are by V, V, V. Okay, when I take it, I'll show you. Is it VOF? Oh, I forgot what it was. It's a sports brand. Okay, the last item I got from American Way. You guys saw the big, heavy, Italian crushed velvet bolero jacket. But guess what? I found a mini skirt because you guys saw me style it with a, a little button down men's shirt I found the mini skirt that can go underneath it is that the top no yeah I did it upside down yes kind of teeny tiny but it was half of $2.99 I can't wait to style it together I'm psyched I am psyched 100% elasticized made in italy i can't wait to wear them together let me see right here it says made in italy way up here on the top and um 100 something right here well these are italian pieces so you guys will get to see it so i am now that i found the skirt hallelujah i'm going to style the heck out of that jacket with this and some long patent leather boots. Maybe I won't do the black boots. Maybe I'll do a different color, maybe red 
or maybe even the taupe, you know, my over the knee boots. I was like, yay, they have it. So that's what I got from America Way. I spent $11. <laughs> Usually if you spend more than $10, you cannot pay by card. You have to pay by, by cash. So when he said eleven fifty, I said, oh, I barely made it because I ain't had no cash. You know, I had cash. I only had like $6. <laughs> so, but I was happy to have this. It was my best buy because now I have a whole set that I can rock them together. Look like I just came out of the street of Milan. You're going to see. You're going to see. We're going to see. All right, next place I went that I, I I just was flabbergasted by the prices was Salvation Army. I haven't been in Salvation Army for more than a year. So I went this time. I found this beautiful leather jacket by, by Prague or Parug. I think this, I think this used to be in target this brand oh no i could be wrong but do you see this leather jacket it's distress it's calf skin red is in and once upon a time i would have paid maybe 9.99 but here it was 16.99 16.99 but you know it's okay i love it because i was going to go to uptown cheapskate and get a navy leather jacket for 30 dollars because I love the way it's made. But then I saw this red one. I'm like, oh, I've time to wait. So I got this. It's super heavy. 100% genuine leather. Right here. Shell, leather, and how to clean it. I tried to show you guys while I was in the store. I don't know if I... It's a size medium right here all leather and clean with leather cleaners only and then it has like a serial number and then the lining on the inside is like snake skin which you know it's okay size medium i wish it was a large but it's still gonna fit me i tried it on it fits i don't know if i'm gonna zip it up if i wear it probably not but um yeah 16 dollars we got that i don't think should i try it on no because you guys saw me try it on already the next one because if i start trying on one item then it's like whoa maybe i'll try it on at the end the next one this is the first one i picked I went to the men's section. They had no blazers. They had an H and M blazer, and they wanted twenty four dollars in the men's section. I was like, please, I can go to H and M and buy that for sixteen ninety nine. You know, everybody's having a sale. So there is this tweed blazer for twelve ninety nine, brand new, by the brand. See, it has the brand on there. Do y'all see how this is super heavy? For a minute, I thought it was Rachel Zell. But this is a brand called, what's this called again? Mina Selly. Oh, wait. Mina, Mina Self. Mina Self. Okay. You see that? Never heard of it before. I was trying to see if they had a price on here. Mina Self. No price. I was trying to see if they had a suggested retail price on this. I'm going to have to Google smuggle it. Size large. It really does not fit like a large. It, fit, it fits very small. This was $12.99. It's the first thing I picked up. I was like, $12.99, I can, you know, manage that. But once upon a time, blazers were all $9. Why are we doing this Salvation Army? Why? It's black and gold. I have so many black and gold tweed blazers but they're all different in their own kind of way so when i'm styling them they, they won't look like you i'm wearing you know 
the same thing. So now is this three piece. I don't know how I'm gonna show you all because they didn't they took it off the hanger. I'll just take them off separately. It's a three piece fashion nova. Can't wait to rock this size large. Or is it extra large? No, size large. Fashion nova three piece for $24.99. But then I he gave me a coupon because I had asked, I was like, ah, do you guys have any coupon? And he says, yes, for the most expensive item, which was this one, $24.99. I'm like, shoo. Here's the blazer by itself. It's a three-piece, guys. It's beautiful. And here is, it has a little top like a bralette more of a bralette that went underneath it who's gonna wear this huh jackie oh no no nah. we gonna see <laughs> yes it says two of three so there's that and the third piece and this one says three of three it's the mini skirt so it's a three piece for I literally pay eighteen dollars for all three, even though they wanted twenty four but your girl I, you know my son used to usually get um embarrassed when I ask questions, and I keep trying to teach him I was like, listen, a closed mouth don't get fed, you can't be hungry and don't say nothing because nobody knows you're hungry so always ask questions because if i didn't ask him he wouldn't give me no coupon because if he was there with me he would have been like oh. i'm like oh, excuse me you got coupon <laughs> and he said yeah of course so yeah look at that three piece beautiful green it's gonna i don't know what color boots i'm gonna wear with this i'm gonna have to look at my boot collection yeah so this is what your girl got today. I didn't make it to Uptown. That's a tomorrow. I want to give myself stuff to do instead of sitting at home every day. And Because when I sit at home, I eat a lot. I haven't been to the gym the whole of this new year. But I've, doing, I've done a lot of, um, a little bit of weightlifting at home because I have those uh, 15 pounds. 15 pounds dumbbells so i've been doing those but i haven't been to the gym to do my treadmill i feel like me going out there walking around in the store that's enough treadmill okay that's enough exercise you know especially when when it goes back to school my whole exercise routine just go off the whack so i'm like sitting at home looking at going to the pantry see what i can find all right guys this one item came from Goodwill. I think I should, I did a Goodwill thrift haul last week and I forgot that I have bought the Zara denim dress. This is extra small. Wait, I can wear it as a duster. It's a, it's a Zara denim dress. Got the belt. I can just wear it as a duster. Don't have to close it. It's right there. I don't know if you can see it says Zara right here. I'm gonna have to try this for you guys. And this is $12.99. But once more, I do get 20% off. Cuckoo. So I don't know. My hands are looking mighty small. <laughs> but yes, guys, that's my thrifting for today wednesday let me show you how some of these jackets how they fit me okay let me take off this vos that's, that's what it is okay let me take this off it's my outer jacket i have it on because it's super cold in my garage do you see this two-piece vos Thing. It's it's a D it's Didi's. 
the top was only $4.99 the pants was $3.99 it is super thick super heavy VOS sports all right so let me try let me try the leather jacket let's take out this let's see how this looks i just got a t-shirt underneath it guys so this is how i go thrifting Ooh, static guard static static think it was gonna fit good when i tried it in the store i think maybe because i had the other jacket on the vos can i zip it though i will never zip it though but let me try let's try oh look at that voila the only thing in the pockets are this way not that way even though i would never wear all the zip top but then again if it gets super cold why not i love the pockets mm -hmm. 16.99 cute so i post this in this channel because some of this stuff i'm not married to them if it's something i will let go if you ask me i will let it go if not i will keep it this particular leather jacket this might i might have to keep this one because you know red is in but for the right price you can have it <laughs> all right the next one is the tweed now being that i have 20 million tweeds this one i'm i'm willing to let go this is gonna go in the store in the boutique now if y'all don't pick it up it's gonna go upstairs size large double breasted only reason is i have so many rachel zo blazers that look exactly like this ah. I don't have time to be doing all that right now. Let me just button it. Cute, huh? Still new with the tags by Mina Self. The hands don't have no... Um, it almost look like this one from but this is different. It's another tweed. It almost look like this. This one is Mina Selfie and this one is from, I think I, yeah, I had thrifted this from Hope for the Valley. But it's made by Shein. It's a little lighter doesn't have any lining but this one is so very well made it's lined it's a blazer trying to give you that ball ball man look that everybody's doing double breasted yeah yeah just notice how you can pair this up with the bag the mishka bag do you see that tweeds you know they're also familiar even though the chat the buttons here is so sil is silver but you can mix your you know your metals you can wear with this the bag of mishka with the black poles cross body affordable shopping 
I'm loving this. Super, super, super cute. Yeah. I run out the house. No force, no moss. Bag is secure. Blazer is given. Got my comfortable pants. Whew. All right. another tweed bagley mishka tweed okay tweed is happening you can wear tweed all through the spring this is another boy bag bagley mishka boy bag this one has a longer strap super cute if you just want to wear it together you can do tweeds can be done together even though this one has a white um, threading this one has a gold threading but it does have some white to it too so we have gold and white threading here and this one we just have white and black threading so cute huh okay see how and if you don't want to wear it, button up you can just make it super casual What, the next one, I'm going to try the Fashion Nova, the Fashion Nova jacket. Not so much. The, maybe I'll try the skirt. And I don't think I'm going to try the top. So let me try the whole thing. This one, I'm going to have to turn it off. So guys, here is the two-piece. I kind of paired it up with my Zara cowboy boots. So there's an issue with the skirt. The zipper is cheap. It's one of those zippers that splits. When you try to zip it up, it kind of splits. I see why I ended up at freaking Salvation Army. So let's put the blade on. I mean, I can have it fixed. Not a big deal. Yeah. So here we go. Oh, what's the thing poking me? The tag is poking me. So yes, guys. Here is it. I didn't think I was going to be able to wear it crop, but why not? The zipper is no bueno. But that's okay. I can still wear it as such. But I, I think I will have it fixed. I think I will have it fixed. So here's the three piece. Fashion Nova. Let me um, pull out my, ooh, my Italian Tuscany bag. Got the cowboy boots on only because that's the only thing that's down here boot wise. This is Zara. It's a little big for me. Brand spiking new. It's a size. <laughs> if I believe you me, it's a 41. I don't have to wear like a thick socks. But they're super comfortable. So yeah, paired it up with this, looking mighty cute, yes. And uh, I did not know this was gonna look so good. Unfortunately, the skirt is wacky. So that's that. All right, so this is it. What else do I have to try on? I don't know if I want to. I'm going to have to try this on with the jacket, but the jacket is upstairs, so we can't do that. We could try this heavy duty sweater, maybe with some jeans. No need to try on a, a sweater, but I see people styling sweaters. It's like a sweater is a sweater. What, why do you have to style a sweater? You just throw it on. Now this one with the shoulder pad, the Italian piece. Now this one, I'm gonna have to do either the matching Italian pants that went with it, or I could just wear it with some jeans. So yes, guys, that's my, let me get myself back so then I can close this little thrift 
Ah, oh, this fashion nova is super cute. Look at me trying to show my belly. Who do you think you are, Jackie? Sheesh. Who do you think you are? Hmm. All right. <laughs> Let me do a thumbnail. Because then my son will be like, Mom, you don't have a thumbnail. And then he'll be stressing. Okay. But anyway, I'll come back to you all later. All right, guys, so here is the Zara denim, a little too small, but I will definitely wear it as a duster. Yeah, I just wear it as a duster, guys. And I, I, I got to open the sleeves up because they're all buttoned, and my jewelry is getting cut up. Hey, I want to mess that up just for trying on stuff. But yeah, see, you guys see how small this is? And I love it. I do. Because I'm going to wear something cute. A beautiful t-shirt, maybe a logo t-shirt underneath it. And then just do this. So, yeah. So, guys, I was telling you those boots are by Zara. They are by Mango. <laughs> the cowboy boots are... Oh man, if I do not do this, I am going to mess it up. Okay. I don't want to mess up my beads. Please don't do it. Don't do it. Okay. So there's that. Yeah. These boots, I had thrifted them. 100% genuine leather. Actually, it's a size 42. Brand Spanky. No, I did get this from. Goodwill for $14.99. It's mango. Beautiful. Smells yummy. Yeah. So they have copies of this, like, you know, LA showroom. I did get one of DDs for like $3 on sale. But this one here is all leather. See it right here? Mango. I give you the online shopping everything from from mango right there i thought it was zara but no it was mango it's right there i'm still going web. i really am so guys this is end of my video this this is what i was trying to tell you this is vos sports see how thick this is i got this adidas for only 4.99 and the pants were only i think 3.99 t-shirt 3.99 all this i this is all dds this hat was going from dds too way before the holidays there it's like a corduroy Little pants, you guys know I have a Chanel one that looks just like this, but this one is cute. So they have, I have to get a red one. I don't know why I didn't get the red. They are super heavy. But, but we, I think the red just had the jacket. I was like, red is in. Why didn't you get the red jacket? So this top is a large. The pants are small. They are super stretchy. So that's how I went running out of the house today. I had on my chunky <laughs> mountain boots from Zara. These two was super big on me. I had gotten this from Marshalls about two years ago. And I just happened to find it in my closet. I was like, ah, time to wear this baby. So, and then I have on my wallet on the chain. Because, you know, when you go thrifting, hello, free hands bag is secure being that it was so cold i w i was wearing my avec la fils which is with my girls in french jacket beautiful i had gone to some marshalls for like i don't remember on sale for maybe like 17 dollars i had two colors it's has a parachute fabric so yes that's how your girl is looking today so I hope you guys 
like this beautiful thrifting video that's all i got for you and now i'm missing my braids because now every time i come to you guys i have to do my hair usually with the braids i was just like oh, i'm ready ready freddy so please share my video oh jesus christ why would you do that why would you fall cold in here anyway please share my video guys give me thumbs up that's all i got to show you was a little thrift haul that's just me creating content getting out of the house i don't know something has happened to my videos i used to have so many views now they're like trickling like but in this channel i'm okay with the less views that i have because this is a brand new channel this channel was created like it's not been it's not even a year old so this particular channel but my other channel my bigger channel i don't know what's going on with the views so can you guys please give me thumbs up and share my video so youtube will put me out there and says hey she's doing something so ever since i took a break coming back strong it's been hard it's like i'm trying to create content sometimes i'm like huh eh, i don't feel like it but then i start thinking about oh what should i eat oh where should i go so um this is keeping me busy this like it's like a job okay this is like my own job for myself the days that i don't feel like it i don't have to Nobody is sponsoring. I don't have to work for anybody. So I have, oh, I got to put this video out because I'm doing collaboration, blah, blah, blah. Your girl don't have time for nobody's co collaboration. I just don't. I mean, I've been asked a couple of times and I'm like, this is work. I stopped working retail because I didn't want to work. I want to work for me. I don't want somebody telling me I need to set, put a video out at a certain time, blah, blah, blah. I ain't got it in me. You're youngest. You all got that. Knock yourself out. I ain't doing it. I work for me if i make ten dollars <laughs> that day or that week it's my ten dollars nobody's taking two dollars out of it nobody's doing anything this is just me if i feel like i ain't trying to make any money i ain't gonna have to i ain't gonna have to what is that <laughs> i don't have to ah! mm -mm -mm. all right i'm speaking spanglish oh patois but anyway, guys, yes, yeah, so my next video will be on the flip side, my other channel, Fabulous Jackie. So I hope you enjoyed. I will see you guys soon. We are going to have a live sale beginning of February. We're going to take January off. But if you see some things in this boutique that you'll be like, wait a minute now, Jackie. How much is whatever is there? Just ask more, you know? The, the, the boutique ain't closed. What I need to do is put everything on a website. I need to create a website. That's what your girl needs to do. I need to get off my ass and create a website so you guys could just go there and shop. You know, instead of me coming to you live, like, huh. By the website, I have to sit down and list up. Do I have time for all that? No, I don't. It means I'll have to pile it on my son, and I don't want to do that. So, this is it, though. I hope you guys enjoyed. Love you. I see you later on the flip side. Bye, guys.